Hey guys, KFC Colonel right here. And today I am going to be making my a part one of a comic book collection. And today's part, which is part number one, is gonna be Spider-Man. So let's get into it, fellas. Okay. I as you can see I have my thing right here. This isn't all of them just because I sorted them in a way that I know. <clears throat> But, like the one, the Spider-Man from Secret Wars, he's not going to be in this. So, yeah, let's get into it. Just starting off with a couple older books from like the 90s. And this one was actually part of my last episode, which is Maximum Clonage 4 of 6. Pretty cool. And Maximum Carnage, as you can see, I picked it mostly just for that, and this is part, uh, I can't see the part, but let me just take this, stick. okay, I can't really see it, but this is 7 of 14, I just saw it just enough for me to, like, tell, and I have every Spider-Man ever, Spider-Verse number 2, I am sorry about the dogs, they are very annoying. <clears throat> yeah, this is just a very cool cover. As you can see, Spider-Punk? Yeah, Spider-Punk's there. I think, yeah, Superior Spider-Man. Like, there's a lot of different Spider-Men that I really enjoy on this. <clears throat> I also have Spider-Verse number three. <clears throat> Sorry, there's something in my throat. I also have The Amazing Spider-Man Annual number one. So that is very, very cool. And the Spectacular Spider-Man, The Hunger Part 1. And I think this is number issue number one. If any of you guys know, just let me know down below. And an older book that... Yeah, an older book, which is very, very cool in my opinion. And I'm trying to find what number it is, but I can't. So if you guys know what issue this is, just let me know. But it's a very cool cover. I think I got this when I had my tonsils out or my gallbladder out. One of those. And fun fact, this was actually one of the first comic books I ever got. And it's The Amazing Spider-Man vs. Alpha. Well, it's... Issue number 694 of this Spider-Man run. So that is very cool. And it's actually the one month anniversary of Alpha. <clears throat> from what it's saying on that. And another book which I just picked up just because I thought it looked pretty cool. Is Marvel Team Up featuring Spider-Man. I get that it's not just a completely Spider-Man issue. But it had Spider-Man bigger than the other ones. So. But this is issue number 44. So pretty cool. Sorry if I'm like looking at them more. I haven't seen some of these in a while. And also Edge of Spider-Verse number 5. And this is the new like Build-A-Figure, I believe. And it's very, very cool. Oh, a page is stuck together. So, yep, yeah, as you can see, they're... There is a new build of figure and there is the mm, Daredevil. So pretty cool. <clears throat> and I got this one when I got my gallbladder out, I know. And this is issue number 109 of the all new, all daring Peter Parker, the spectacular Spider Man, when he's wearing his like black outfit. And I believe this was like the 80s. Yeah, 1985. And then, like, one big issue, literally one big issue, because it's, like, thick. I, like, that's pretty thick. And this is, like, Spider-Man after he came back from being Superior Spider-Man, so that's very cool. And it also has an issue of Inhumans in here, so that's pretty cool. And it's a little, like... Um, what's the word? Bent in the corner, but uh, here is uh, Spidey number 36. Pretty cool. 
and I'm going to try and hurry this up a little bit just because I'm already at almost 10 minutes and I've barely gone through like half of it. But Marvel Team Up Spider Man and Kazar number 19, I believe. So cool. And Goblin Nation number 1, the Superior Spider Man number 27. I just picked that up just because the cover looked dope. Like a lot of these I just picked up just because I liked the cover of them. And here is Web of, Sp of Spider-Man number, like, three, I believe. So, pretty cool. And here is the 100th anniversary. It's a variant cover of, like, a Spider-Man comic. I don't know which one, but it's number one. And I picked it up just because it's cool. That's actually Kingpin with the Venom symbiote, so... And here is Maximum Carnage number four of four. So pretty cool. <clears throat> and another like issue I got when I had my gallbladder out is uh, Web of Spider-Man number 105. So I thought that was pretty cool. And here is Planet of the Symbiotes number two of five, number one. Uh, I'm just reading what I'm seeing on it. So, and here's the Superior Spider-Man number seventeen. So cool. And here is Scarlet Spider-Man. I don't know what number this is, but I just picked it up just because it looked really cool. So. <clears throat> and here is the Sensational Spider-Man Web of Carnage number 104. And here's actually one of the first issues I ever picked up for comic books. Let me just kind of scoot those into a pile. And that would be the Sensational Spider-Man. Uh, the Return of Kane Part 2 of 4, and I just loved the cover, so. This is just going to be kind of quick because it says I have like a minute or something left. And the next one I have is Superior Spider-Man Team Up number 1. Again, cool cover. And Maximum Clonage number 3 of 6. And another recent one I picked up is... Web of Spider-Man, Web of Life, number three of four. And the last two are Edge of Spider-Verse, Spider-Man Noir, and Spider-Verse number one. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, my time's about to run out, guys, for doing this video, so I just want to say thank you all for watching, and have a very sexy, delicious day.